To write the formula for carbonic acid, we first need to determine what type of acid we're dealing with. So from the chart here, we can see it doesn't begin with hydro, so we don't need to worry about that. And then the ending, IC, does end in ic, not OUS. So we'll use rules that apply to this type of acid. The first thing we need to do is write the polyatomic ion that's attached to the hydrogen in this acid. So we'll write the stem, that's the C-A-R-B-O-N, and then instead of ic, we're going to change that to A-T-E. That means we have the carbonate polyatomic ion, and we can go to the common ion table and look that up. When we do, we see that carbonate is CO3 2 minus. Next, we write H in front of that, and then we need to balance our charges. We have this minus 2, that applies to the whole carbonate ion, and hydrogen is always in plus 1, it's in group 1, so I'm going to need two hydrogens to balance out this minus 2 charge. 2 times the plus 1, that'll give me a plus 2, that'll balance the charges. And that'll make this the formula for carbonic acid. Let's clean this up a bit. And there you have it, carbonic acid, H2CO3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.